Have you ever dreamed or hoped or wished that you were something special and everything magically would happen to you because of that? Hi, this is Karma Spence, the Own Your Awesome Mentor. And I was thinking about this idea over the weekend that there's this common theme in especially children's stories, but it actually happens sometimes in adult stories and in real life. And the theme is this. The protagonist, the central figure of the story, is living a really depressing, sometimes abused life. Life is not great. And then some key trigger moment happens where their entire life changes because they discover that they've been special all along. And so they go on to achieve things that they never thought were possible. To give this a little more concrete example, think Cinderella. She's being picked on by her stepsisters and her stepmother. And then her magical fairy godmother comes in and gives her glass slippers and she falls in love with the prince and lives happily ever after. Think Harry Potter. He's living under the stairs with his adopted family who treats him terribly. And then he gets an invitation to Hogwarts and his whole life changes. And in film, there's the Princess Diaries. This girl's just living her ordinary life, and then it discovers, oh, wow, she's a princess. And in real life, there's a book called Rocket Boys that was made into the movie called October Sky. And this guy, he's living in this mining town. Business is going elsewhere. Life is depressing. And then he discovers his love of rockets. He inspires the, his whole town to support him in going to a science fair where he like gets a really good prize in a science fair and he ends up leaving the town and becoming a rocket scientist. So you'll see in all these stories, you start off here, there's a trigger moment, and then the sky's the limit. And I believe that the reason why this is such a common theme in stories is that we all wish for more from our lives. We wish we were special. Now, you might know where I'm going here, given that I am the own your awesome mentor, right? You are special. You don't need an outside trigger. You don't need a fairy godmother. You don't need an invitation to Hogwarts. What you need is like what happened to the guy in Rocket Boys or October Sky. What you need is to go inside and find your passion. Own your awesome because you have something. You probably have more than one something that's really awesome. Find that and go for it because that is your trigger. You need to create your own trigger because you are special right now. Right now you are special. And if you own that part of you that's special and develop the courage to go for your dreams, then yes, amazing things can happen to you. Okay, you may not have glass slippers and marry a prince. Okay, you may not discover that you're a wizard and are the key to defeating the evil wizard. But what you will discover is that you have a unique and wonderful and awesome purpose in this world that only you can fulfill. And the key to that is owning your awesome. This is Karma Spence, the Own Your Awesome Mentor. Remember this. Think outside that box because you don't want to hem yourself in. Spread your wings and fly because only you can do what you're meant to do here on this world. You, yes, you are capable of more than you know. If you only own it, you can do it. If you like this video, please like it on YouTube and leave a comment below. I want to hear from you. I want to hear your thoughts about this video. Hey, you can even comment on past videos. And if you have questions you'd like me to answer in a future video, please comment below. Let me know. Talk to me. I want the weekday wisdom to be something that you value and look forward to watching.